Hola, New York. Well, good evening, everyone. Um, I'm extremely honored to have the opportunity to be here. Thank you to the Writers Association and everyone here tonight. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm extremely excited because as a kid, I grew up a Yankee fan. Honestly, honestly, I was a Yankee fan. But then when I got to be a player and I was in A-ball, I realized that I was just an object that could be moved to any team. So I had to quit it and become a baseball player. But, uh, you know, when you stop to watch the players or you play the game for a long time, most of the time you don't get the feel that the true fans have for the players. And in my case, after a ball, I, I could never be a fan again. And, but there are players in this group of guys that I have here, all of you, that really make you feel like a fan. And uh, the guy I'm, in, uh, I'm, I'm calling tonight is one of those guys that not only had me as a fan, watching him at home and following him everywhere he goes, and I'm extremely proud, extremely proud to get the opportunity to see guys like him, CC, Mike Trout, uh, on and on and on and on, the Big Bear, everybody. <laughs> um, I'm extremely proud to be the one presenting uh, the outstanding National League Cy Young Award winner, Jacob DeGrom. You have me in my chair. <laughs> You had me in my chair, watching you every time you pitch. I'm extremely proud to have the opportunity to represent your Cy Young, National League Cy Young Award winner. Oh. All right, we all know speeches are my favorite thing, but um, <laughs> First of all, I'd like to thank uh, God for the opportunity to play this game. Um, none of this would be possible without him, so all the glory to him. Um, as a kid growing up, uh, it was a dream just to play baseball, play college baseball, and then Major League Baseball was the ultimate dream. Um, and to be up here receiving uh, my second Cy Young Award from Pedro Martinez, um, you know, I, I don't think I ever would have dreamt that, and it's really kind of an unreal moment. Um, with that being said, none of this would be possible without um, the people around me. Um, there's a lot of people that have contributed to this and um, played a big role in this, and I would like to thank some of those people. Uh, first of all, my wife, Stacy. Um, <laughs> Thank you for everything you do, um, for supporting me, um, letting me live this dream, and just being there um, and rooting me on every fifth day. Um, next, my parents. Uh, my dad's just here tonight. Um, my mom's home with the kids, so we were going to bring them, but we saw it was raining, so we said we'd leave them at home with her, so she stayed home. And the sacrifices that my parents made throughout my life for uh, me to be able to play this game and um, everything that they did, raising me right. Um, and dad, still to this day, playing catch. Uh, thank you for everything you guys do. Um, <laughs> next, I would like to thank my teammates, um, both past and present. Um, you know, these guys are, are your, you know, your family away from your family. Um, great guys to be around. Um, and guys who I've played with in the past, just how they taught me how to play this game and, and go about, um, playing the game the right way. So a big thank you uh, to those guys. Um, the next coaches throughout my whole career. Um, you know, we've had a, I've had a number of coaches from minor leagues uh, to the big leagues um, and taken little bits and pieces from them um, and everything that they've contributed. Um, none of this would be possible without them. Uh, trainers, clubhouse guys, these guys don't get enough credit. Um, constantly working on us every to try to um, get us out there every fifth day. Um, so big thanks to those guys. Um, bullpen catchers. Uh, Dave Racanello and Eric Lango. 
Um, you know, Rax kept me in line pretty much my whole career, <laughs> telling me he's caught better. So I guess he kind of motivates me to continue to go out there and try to get better. Um, next, my agency, CAA, thank you guys for everything you do. Um, big thanks to the Mets. Um, really love playing here. Um, glad to be here for a long time. Next, the baseball writers. Um, this is truly an honor. Like I said, being mentioned uh, just in with guys like Pedro and uh, guys to win two Cy Youngs is um, almost unreal. And thank you guys for the recognition. I really do appreciate it. And last but not least, uh, the Mets fans. Um, <laughs> since since my debut, you guys have been nothing but great to me. And um, I've said it before, there's no better place to pitch. And I love running out on City Field in front of you guys. So thank you guys very much. And thank you guys and look forward to a great 2020.